Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to be talking about the four ways that you can start to eat healthier. I'm also going to be sharing the number one reason why you are not able to maintain a healthy diet. If you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Tabitha and I am here to empower and equip you as a mom and help you have the life that you've always dreamed of having. So let's dive right in. The number one way that you can start eating healthier is by pre-cutting fruits and vegetables. So during the day, you get hungry, you've got a little craving, you want something quick that you can munch on while you're dealing with your toddler or your babies that are running around. So what do you do? You go grab whatever is easiest to eat. It's not going to be a cucumber, it's not gonna be a carrot because those are in the fridge and they're not pre-cut. So what you need to do is at the beginning of your day, take five minutes, pull out those, fr those fruits and vegetables that you know you're going to eat during the day, cut them up, put them in a nice platter on the table. That way you know that when you're hungry, you're, you'll, you will be gravitating toward that instead of gravitating for, towards something that's unhealthy, maybe like a bag of chips or a chocolate bar. Tip number two is meal prepping. Meal prepping is super important to keeping you on a healthy diet. However, it can be really, really overwhelming, especially if you've never done it before. Trust in me, I've been there. So what I'm going to recommend that you do is check out in the description below, I will be leaving a link to a video in which I have detailed very easy ways that you can start on your meal prepping journey. That's all I'll say about that. You should definitely go check it out and you'll see it's not as hard as you think it is. Now, before we go any further, I'm going to share the number one reason why you are not able to maintain a healthy eating lifestyle. And that is because you're going all in. Hear me out. You're going from eating whatever you want, however you want, at all times, to just trying to change your whole lifestyle, all your eating habits, to a healthy place. But mama, you've got more going on than just the way you eat. You've got toddlers, you've got errands to run, you're probably also working in all of that. You don't have time to just change everything like that. And emotionally, it's not easy either. Like that's a big transition. So instead of trying to change everything at once in the way that you eat, why don't you do it in small increments? Just take one step. Just take one tip that I've given you today and start implementing it in your eating lifestyle. And then maybe in two weeks from now, take another one of my tips and start implementing that. And you'll see three months from now, you'll be eating a lot healthier than you are right now. So that's a way that you can do it that will not be overwhelming, that will not be taxing, and that you'll be able to maintain in the long run. Because after all, that is your goal, to be eating healthier a year from now, two years from now, three years from now. If you wanna hear more about healthy ways that you can improve your lifestyle, then don't forget to smash that subscribe button. Third way that you can eat healthier is by focusing on the, the healthy things that you love to eat. So what are those healthy foods that you really, really enjoy eating? If you're like me, I love Caesar salads. It's one of my go-to lunch meals. However, when lunch comes around and I finally got my two girls down for a nap, I don't feel like taking out my lettuce and chopping it all up and getting some bacon bits in there. So what do I do? At the beginning of the week, I chop up a lot of lettuce, I clean it up and I put it in a Ziploc bag and then when lunch comes around, I've just got to take some of that lettuce and put it in the bowl with some bacon bits, some croutons and a nice salad dressing, maybe some cucumbers, maybe some chicken, et voila, I've got a delicious lunch that I absolutely enjoy in the space of three to four minutes. So focus on those things that you love to eat and try to find ways to make it easier for you to eat those things. And you'll see your taste buds will develop. You'll start wanting to try a different salad. In my case, anyway, I've started experimenting with other salads and seeing that actually I thought I didn't like broccoli. I thought it was gross, but if I do a cranberry broccoli salad, it's actually delicious and I love it. Like, I, I just really love it. So try things like that. Focus on the things that you love to eat and start by eating a lot of that, all that healthy goodness. Get it in your body. The last and fourth way that you can start eating healthier has nothing to do with food. And that is to watch YouTube videos like this one that gives you easy tips and tricks that you can integrate into your eating lifestyle. Listen to podcasts, whether you listen to podcasts on Spotify or on Audible or on Apple Music, I think that's what it's called. Listen to those podcasts and you'll see, you'll start training your brain to start thinking about eating healthier and then you'll start acting it out in your life. So there you have it, 
four easy ways for you to start eating healthier. If you enjoyed this content and you want to hear more about how you can have a healthy lifestyle, then smash that subscribe button. Also, you may enjoy watching my YouTube video where, video where I talk about how to work out with two babies under two. On that note, I wish you all an amazing day and uh, don't forget to sip on that coffee if, um, if you're low on energy. Okay. Bye.